Are you into the Google smart speaker ecosystem and wondering if you could turn on your PC or laptop if it's connected to Ethernet by just your voice? Here's how to do it. You will need three apps, namely IFTTT, Automate and Wake on LAN. Download all these apps on your phone. While they download, we will set up the PC to receive the signal from your phone and speakers. Open run, type ncpa.cpl and press enter. Now find your ethernet adapter, right click and select properties, click to configure and go to power management and make sure this allow this device to wake this computer is checked. If you are on a laptop, that's all you need to do. On desktop, however, you will need to go to your UEFI BIOS and enable wake on PCIe or LAN depending on your motherboard manufacturer. The last thing you need from your PC is your hardware address. You can get it by opening the status page of your ethernet and look for hardware address. It should look something like this. Now open wake on LAN app on your phone and enter the hardware address that we just copied. Now just shut down your system and try clicking on the profile that you just set up. Remember you need to be on the same Wi-Fi network to use this app. If your PC wakes up, well done. And if it doesn't, double check all the settings we talked about earlier and correct them as required. Now open the IFTTT app and set up Google Assistant to Android SMS command like so and send yourself in this example, wake my PC. Now remember the part of the SMS that you're going to send to yourself, we will need it in the Automate app. I open the Automate app and set it up like so where it listens for incoming text messages and if it detects quotes wake my PC and quotes and it will trigger wake on LAN app. Now all that's left to do is test it out. Let's just run the command. Google, wake my laptop. Waking up the battle station. Woo, look at that. Certain caveats with this do apply. It only works when your phone is at home and connected to the same Wi-Fi. You can check out my video coming up next week on how to do it from anywhere. And you can combine that video with this so you can wake up your PC from anywhere. Just in the interest of keeping this video short, I've only covered it on how to do it from your local network. And that's pretty much it. All right, smash that like button if this video helped you. Consider subscribing and dinging that notification bell if you want to watch more content like this. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers.